And finally, scientists are using satellites to detect methane emissions from space, and they found landfills to be one of the main culprits. The organic waste decomposing in these landfills is fueling methane emissions, which are responsible for around 30% of global warming. Our report explains how methane impacts the planet and what can be done to prevent further damage. There's a new eye in the sky to keep track of all our climate crimes. Scientists are now using satellites to detect methane emissions from space. There are more than a dozen satellites revolving around the Earth, scanning pollution and feeding that information back to researchers, policymakers and industry experts. When we think about methane emissions, we often picture coal mines or cattle sheds. But according to these satellites, there's a bigger culprit sitting around the corner. It's none other than landfills. Yes, those garbage dumps that you so often see near your homes are one of the biggest reasons for methane emissions across the world. Experts believe that organic waste decomposition in landfills is spewing large amounts of methane. In the US, the Environmental Protection Agency has detected significant methane emissions at more than half of the landfills. It says 80% of these emissions release at least 100 kilograms of methane per hour. The study may have given figures for the US, but almost every country is staring at the same issue. The latest data from India's Space Research Organization, or ISRO, gives a similar picture of the country's landfills. According to ISRO, garbage dumps in the cities of Mumbai, Ahmedabad and Surat are the top three methane hotspots. Together, they emit an average of 15,000 kilograms of methane every single hour. You might wonder why we're so focused on methane emissions. That's because methane is one big troublemaker for our planet. It's a much more potent gas than carbon dioxide at trapping heat. Once it reaches the atmosphere, it has 80 times more warming power than CO2. Methane also has damaging effects on the ozone layer. Ozone depletion can cause increased amounts of UV radiation to reach the Earth, which can lead to deadly skin cancers, cataracts and impaired immune systems. According to the International Energy Agency, methane is currently responsible for around 30% of global warming. Its concentration in the atmosphere is 2.5 times greater than its pre-industrial levels. Agriculture, oil, natural gas and landfills are among the largest sources of methane emissions. Experts say governments can avoid methane generation in landfills by enforcing simple yet effective measures. Keeping organic waste out of garbage dumps can be the first step. It would help prevent methane leaks and boost programs for composting and organic recycling. Additionally, better landfill covers and early gas collection may help halt the release of methane into the atmosphere. The methane detecting satellites are just the beginning. With huge advances in technology, we'll have more visibility into methane pollution than ever before. Let's focus on climate solutions and try to give these eyes in the sky less to see.